Hey guys, what's up? Apple Lee here again with another video. I have here the House of Marley Liberate XLBT. These are a pair of Bluetooth headphones from the House of Marley. Um, so we're just going to unbox them, see what we get inside, and I'll give you my kind of impressions. They're meant to be really good quality headphones, and they're made from recyclable materials, so they're pretty eco-friendly as well. So we'll start by cutting up the label on the bottom here. And then flip it back over. And it's a, it's a magnet on the bottom, so the lid will stay closed. That's nice. And then a little pull tab. We pull the headphones out. And it's a nice, it's a good construction box, solid box. Um, and then we'll put that off to the side. And then inside here we have the headphones themselves. We'll put them there. And then in the bottom here we have a carrying case. It's a kind of canvassy feeling case. And you do have uh, little uh, raster colours there. And then inside the bag we get a micro USB cable. It's probably the standard three foot cable. And a braided headphone cable. And you can see the attention to detail already. You can see on there if it will focus the three colours, they colour in the little plastic bits and I expect that's a uh, good length hopefully I'll tell you later and then in the top here there's some paperwork <laughs> and it's probably the warranty and some of the information about these headphones so it does say noise isolating, eco-friendly, over the ear headphones and I'll leave links to the headphones, both to Amazon and uh, House of Marley website down below. They have some pretty good deals on right now, um, so you can get them for about uh, 120 UK, uh, which I don't know the exact amount in US dollars, but as I said, links to both down below the US and UK stores. And here we have the headphones themselves wrapped up in some tissue paper, House of Marley branded. And here are the headphones themselves. So they fold out, really nice construction. So this is wood on the side here, wood on both sides. Really nice solid metal top. And you've got these drilled holes in the top to give it a quite cool effect with the contrasting canvas look. And they do them in two colours as well, so this is the I would say grey, uh, grey and brown look, but you can get them in a, bra uh, a black look as well. Um, so they do pull out, do they? No, they don't. So they are fixed. Oh, wait, no, they do. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> they do pull out here at the headphones, and you can see some writing on the inside, and they label the left and right ear cup. Uh, they seem pretty soft. They don't seem to be very deep... Uh, here the padding, but I'll um, try them on, see what they're like. Okay, so I just put them on, um, and from the first impressions, they are quite small ear cups. So I've come from a pair of Beats Studio Wireless, the second generation, and this pair, you can see that it's kind of taken up by a lot of padding there, width. So I do feel my ears are a bit squished in the ear cups there. Um, but I have to give it some time to see if they get comfortable. Um, and they're obviously Bluetooth, so you have your controls on the side here. You have your play, pause button, uh, power button, uh, skips, and volume control there. And also you have your headphone jack. This is a 2.5mm headphone jack. It's a bit annoying, so you can see here, this is uh, slightly smaller than the other end, which is 3.5mm. Obviously, it means you can't just use any uh, other other audio cables. So, if they could change that, that'd be awesome. And you can see there at the bottom, the uh, headband does come through. So if you pull it up, they disappear there. Um, but yeah, first impressions of it. It's got a really soft headband actually. Just notice that that is really soft. But um, yeah, if you have any questions about these headphones, leave them down below. 
and I'll try and get back to you. But they seem to be really nice quality, as I said, just a bit uncomfortable on the ear cups. Uh, but yeah, you can just order them, try them on, see what they're like. They do have, uh, you can return them if you don't like them. But this has just been my first uh, impressions of them. They seem pretty good. If you have any questions, leave them down below, as I said. Subscribe and comment, and I'll see you guys in the next video.